Hey guys, what's up? Nico here. Hope you guys like that little intro video. You guys probably would have seen that on TikTok, Instagram, or Facebook. Um, I posted it everywhere. I was really, really excited about it. Anyway, so this video is basically just me talking about this new Kamehameha Blast that I did 3D print. So let's dive into it. Now, the first thing that people noticed, and people are telling me, I should have put the thicker base of the tube towards the end where the blast is. I get that. But if I reverse that, it wouldn't have been as stable when this thing shoots out with a thicker base over there and a thinner base here. Okay. Also, it would have made it a lot heavier putting all the weight towards the end rather than here. So I want for stability and, you know, kind of ease of use, not making it so heavy. So let's look more about, or so let's look more into this thing right here. Now, this thing is a three part print. The top here, or the base, or the blast itself, uh, screws into this telescoping tube. And this is printed by itself, okay, like this. Now this was 3D printed on that P1P right there, and the rest of these were printed on the X1 right behind me. Now, the bottom also screws in, just like so. Now this one, um, my machine got clogged for a little bit, the nozzle, the nozzle, and so, it didn't finish, uh, but I really wanted to test it out. Plus, the color was just way too perfect for me not to. So I just kept it. And look, it just screws right there. Now, this telescoping tube right here prints in place like so. Like that. Okay? It, it sits on your printer just like this. And that's it. No supports, no nothing. And then... After you print it, it's a three-part print, right? You just pull it out and you start attaching your other parts to it. Now, the files for this are going to be on the website at nicoindustries.com or if you're part of the membership at nicoindustriesmembership.com, you guys get it for 10 bucks and then the rest of it, 10 bucks a month. And there we go. Now, this thing is about three feet in length, okay? Now, after we put it all together, it just collapses down like so. And then when you're done, you can just go, ha! <laughs> Man, this thing is so cool. Um, and I printed it again in a different color scheme where there was a blue and green kind of filament blend. I thought it would be cool looking. Um, it is kind of, but there's nothing like that nice blue from the actual show that just, it, it just does something. It just does something. But this is what it looks like with a full um, base that's printed out. Look, it's pretty cool. It looks like it's really shooting out like that. So yeah, um, hope you guys like this video. It was really just for me showcasing it, telling you guys about it. Again, the files for this are at nicoindustries.com. It's eight bucks for the file. Or if you guys want, you can join the membership at 10 bucks a month and you can get that and all the rest of my files, unlimited downloads just for 10 bucks. All right, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.